Hi everyone! So today I will be showing you how to create this really cool galaxy canvas wall art. This is a really fun and easy project to do. It's almost foolproof because you can cover up almost any mistake. So anyways, now without further ado, let's get started. So first off, you'll need a paper plate to put your paints on. You'll also need assorted colors of acrylic paint. Here I am using fabric paint, but I definitely would not recommend using this because it dried way too fast and also started peeling. You'll also need sponges that you don't want because we will be cutting these up later on. You'll need two disposable chopsticks. You'll also need masking tape and a pair of scissors. And of course, you will need a canvas. Mine is just a 12 by 12 inch canvas from the bargain store. You might also want some gloves if you don't want your hands to get messy. So of course, you need to open up your canvas first. And now you want to take your masking tape and tape it onto the canvas in your desired shape or pattern. And when you're finished, make sure to smooth out all of the tape. And now you're going to take your sponge and scissors and we are going to cut this into little squares. They don't have to be perfect because we're just going to use this to sponge on the paint onto our canvas. And once you're done with that, you just want to squeeze all of um, your different colors of paint onto your plate. Don't squeeze too much first because it's easier to add more on rather than put it back in the bottle if you squeeze too much. And I'm also squeezing white and blue together as well as white and purple so I can mix them together with a chopstick later to create light purple and light blue. And now using that same chopstick, I'm mixing my white and blue paints together to create light blue. And now we can finally get started with sponging. So I've got this in fast forward so that way you guys can see um, more of the effects. Um, so I'm starting with my black and now I'm with blue now and I'm just using a different sponge for each color so that way um, it doesn't get contaminated or anything and it's okay if the colors don't blend well together because um, you can blend them later on. However, since I did the mistake of using fabric paint, it does dry faster and is harder to blend so definitely use acrylic paint. I recommend using a new sponge um, for every time you are going to blend two colors. So I had a sponge for blending white and purple, a sponge for blending light purple and dark purple, a sponge for blending purple and dark blue, and you get the hang of it now. But anyways, because um, you want to keep the colors um, not mixed together, but you also want them to blend together as well. So it's kind of a complicated process. But anyways, if you ever get two colors mixed up together, on the canvas just add more of that color on and then keep blending and now I'm starting to add my light blue on my canvas and just to let you know you definitely don't have to do the same galaxy kind of pattern that I'm doing you can definitely start um, using a different color at a different spot And so after about an hour of sponging, I have now finished my whole entire canvas and I also added on some glitter colors on the side as you can see and also silver along the white. And so now we're going to add on stars. So I just took my chopstick and used white paint on the tip and then I'm just doing kind of lines of groups of stars along where the colors um, meet. This kind of creates a really cool realistic look.
And once you are happy with however many stars you put all over your canvas, we are now ready to go ahead and peel off the tape design that we put on to our canvas. And we are now done with our really cool galaxy canvas wall art. So mine did get a little bit messy around the edges here, but that's totally okay. If you would like to make your wall art last a little bit longer, you can go um, and spray it with finishing spray or even hairspray just to make sure that the paint doesn't start to peel. And yeah, so don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you made your own canvas wall art and also hit the subscribe button on your way out. If you did make um, your own canvas wall art don't forget to post it on Instagram Pinterest Twitter or Facebook and tag me in it in some way so that way I can see it and give it a like and maybe comment if I can and yeah so once again thank you guys so much for watching this really cool art tutorial and I will see you guys later bye